I got lost at the airport. Hey Bloomies, good morning. This is like two days after I got here. Guys, <laughs> I got lost at the airport. Hey, Funny, right? I don't really like uh it is actually good to like you know try things for the first time but there are some things i don't really like trying for the first time so there was i also remember the first time i went to the bank like the, i just like i get anxious whenever i'm trying some things for the first time i got to dubai airport that place is beautiful what that place is beautiful and so 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 big like everything is just in place when i got to when i <laughs> that's what they say they will say follow person where no road do follow person where no road do <laughs> where we where we where we landed mm. and because i think some people were actually doing like connecting flights like um they were like they are like going to another country so they stopped first at dubai then they now like board another plane to where they are going to so when i dropped here most of the people that i saw on the plane i didn't see them so i saw like i noticed these two guys and i was following them because they said okay that we should that we have to go get our boxes uh you know and funny thing i was when, okay wait i was supposed to go get our like our luggages and all so i was following them i was thinking they knew where they were going to go and because i didn't know that you need to like clear yourself at immigration first before you are able to like get your box i didn't know so when i dropped i saw these guys they took a no they took an elevator to the next stop and i followed them like <laughs> that was so so dumb and when i go i kept seeing you know like in the airport now you see sign post and everything i was seeing departure departure i'm like I'm not supposed to be in departure. I just got in. I just arrived. So I kept, and my brother was already waiting for me at the airport. He came to pick me. So I was just going round, 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 round. <laughs> my brother was like, Sister, where are you? I'm like, I don't know that. I'm here to get my boxes, blah, blah, blah. So I walked up to like the, um, the airport's attendant. And I was like, oh, that this is my issue and everything. And I was also making a mistake. I so right now I'm editing this video and I noticed that I skipped like a I skipped like a crucial part in the video. So you know I mentioned that I got lost at the airport and that was because I was trying to like locate my where I was going to pick my luggage. And usually I'm supposed to pass through immigration first. So normally when you're about when the plane is about to land they will tell you where to get your luggages from when the plane was about to land for my flight they mentioned 13 but in my head i don't know how i recorded c13 so when i when we got into like the airport to get our boxes to get our luggages i was like i was saying c13 c13 anytime i woke up to like uh, no even before i walked up like i kept checking for seat and i was like i'm not seeing seat 13. so i walked up to one of like the, you know all the the men and the women on the, the sea walking around so i told one of the guys that oh that i'm looking for c i was i'm looking for c13 and at first he was confused it was like c13 then i now told him that okay that the problem the issue is i just arrived and i'm trying to like get my box then he said it is not c13 that it is Thirteen, and I have to go down, go through immigration first before I will be able to like get my luggage. So I just want to like clear this up so that we'll be on the same page. So let's head right into the video. <laughs> Instead of saying thirteen, I was saying thirteen C. I was saying C thirteen, and they were kind of confused. So they're like, I now told them that okay, I just got into Dubai. That I just arrived. They now said, oh, that no, they have to go back downstairs. Um, so I went back downstairs. My brother was like, what is happening? And I said, ah, nah, I don't know. I'm here to get my boxes. And he said, my brother and I said, you're supposed to go through immigration. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> ah, I felt so embarrassed. And my brother, 
the way he's going to be shading you and like you know chipping in some some mini mini insults it was just making just of me you know what girl i was like that, i was telling the airport attendant that please i need to get my box and they're like box box do you mean luggage <laughs> so i said yes i want to get my my luggage then i said oh they have to go through immigration first so i went through immigration get my box hey, my brother brought me to the hotel room so funny thing is when i got into the hotel room for some weird reason i perceived like this weird smell and i thought i was the only one not knowing that my brothers was perceiving it i should have noticed that it was doing like <laughs> but i didn't see anything he kept doing it then the next thing he started sniffing my hair he sniffed my clothes i'm like hey mom is everything okay then he said that he's perceiving something i was like that means i'm perceiving it too and when I left Nigeria, I wasn't past, I wasn't smelling, so where is the smell coming from? So for some reason, I went towards my box and I noticed that the smell was coming from my box. Then I noticed that there's this tag that they attach to your box when you are traveling with. I noticed like um, something spilled on it or something. So I smelled it and I noticed that the smell was coming from that paper. I don't know, probably where they placed my box, they placed somebody else's box on mine. So maybe there is something inside the person's box. I didn't. I don't know. But I noticed that something just spilled on my box, and it was smelling like the smell was so so strong. At first, I thought it was a sandals, but it wasn't my sandals. So my brother suggested that I sprayed the room. So I sprayed the room, but this thing was still smelling. So I was like, I can't deal with this any longer. Like for how long do? So I had to. I carried my box and I had to like scrub it before the smell now died down. But this place feels so so safe you know when i went out yesterday i used google map and i was just like i was just walking freely on the road with my passport too <laughs> before they nabbed me i felt honestly i felt so safe like i didn't have to like look at my back to be scared of if somebody was following me yeah i think this should be the end of this introduction video See you in the next video. I love you guys so much. Thank you for always coming back to watch my videos. Bye.